Welcome back. As I mentioned, we have William here on behalf of Recreation. Well, welcome. Thank you for having me, Lisa. I know you have lots of great things in store. <laughs> We've been advertising a few of them already. Yes. So very excited. So let's just jump right in. So yes, yeah, so we, we have uh, several different events coming up. Um, we have one event coming up this Saturday, our Health and Wellness Expo. Right. Uh, the Health and Wellness Expo is a sponsor. We have a title sponsor, Memorial Care. Right. Uh, we also have a diamond sponsor, Providence St. Joseph Healthcare. Oh. And we also have a platinum sponsor, uh, Parentis Health. Okay. Um, the Memorial Care will be having free lectures and screenings during this event. Okay. Um, and there will also be prizes. Um, so there we have a sponsor passport. So if you go and visit each one of the sponsors, they'll each give you a little stamp. And then right. at the when you complete this, the passport, you can turn it in and be entered into a raffle for prizes. That's um, great. And you look at all these people. I mean, you yes. have a lot of folks. How many It'll, vendors do you think you'll have? Uh, I think there's a 25 vendors. Oh, okay. Um, so, and they all provide great benefits, great uh, opportunities for you to check out. If, okay. if things to help you out in the day to day and, okay. and down the line. Um, so it, it's a it's a great place to go to and visit uh, okay. this Saturday if you have time between 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. at Clubhouse Five. Perfect. <laughs> Um, also coming up afterwards, the following weekend, we have the Village Bazaar. Mm -hmm. The Village Bazaar is a resident-driven, uh, where residents go there, they sell their wares, their arts, their, uh, their knickknacks, their jewelry, that kind of thing. Okay. Um, think of it, and it'll be held at Clubhouse 5 also, Saturday, April 1st from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Okay. in the Clubhouse 5 parking lot. Kind of like a swap meet. Kind of like a swap meet, yes. It, okay. um, so all the residents are excited to have tables there. They'll, they'll be setting up and uh, we're always expecting a good crowd, mm -hmm. usually 300, 400 people. Well, yeah, you now, you now expanded it to twice a year, I think, right? Uh, it's actually happening three times a year oh, now. three times a year yes, now. This it's is, so this popular. Is, it is so We had decided <laughs> to add a third one, yes. <laughs> Um, I love so it. So all the, all the residents are excited to be able to go there and either sell their wares or attend. Well, yeah, but what's nice is that you're, you're giving people who are artists uh, mm. from the village an opportunity yes. to sell their stuff because yes. not always do they have that opportunity. Mm -hmm. And if we've seen some of the talent here in oh, our community sure. center with the art, you can certainly get some of their art, too. Uh, yes. do, do you expect to see um, a few artists there selling their Fantastic. wares? Fantastic. Yes. Excellent. Um, Following that, we have a couple of Easter events over mm -hmm. on Saturday, uh, April 8th, over at the Equestrian Center. Uh, we'll be having our Easter extravaganza. I love um, it. The event will be from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. There will be egg hunts. There's going to be a petting zoo. There's going to be bounce houses. There's going to be a lot of fun things to do mm -hmm. um, with, um, you know, mo it's mostly catering towards uh, grandparents and their grandchildren. And right. their um, so it'll be a fun time for the family. Um, ex there will be different egg hunts depending on what age group your grandchildren may be or right. your children. Uh, so for zero to three years old, 9.30 a.m. is the egg hunt. Then for six to uh, four to six years old, 10 a.m. will be the egg hunt. And then mm -hmm. following the seven to 10 year olds, uh, 10.30 will be the egg okay. hunt. And they uh, need to bring their own baskets. They need to bring their own okay. baskets, yes. Um, there's also going to be um, artists there like doing face paintings oh, okay. and, and fun things of that nature. So look forward to that for your next family function on April 8th over the <laughs> Equestrian Center. Well, now they'll, and there's a petting zoo too. Will they also get to see some of the horses? Oh yeah, for sure. Oh, uh, we have a miniature horse named Sebi oh, there who Sebi. will be making an appearance. Oh, I, <laughs> yeah. he's so popular. He is he's a little popular. celebrity. <laughs> uh, and then uh, the day after, on uh, Sunday, April 9th, we're going to be having an Easter buffet over That's at Clubhouse 5. Mm -hmm. um, this event is actually very close to selling out. Uh, so I'd recommend, if you're interested in ha uh, going to this event, um, going over to Clubhouse 5 um, mm -hmm. tomorrow. Today, actually, Clubhouse 5 is closed. It's, they're having some renovate, um, some maintenance work being done. So tomorrow, go to Clubhouse 5, get your tickets for the Easter buffet. It'll okay. be held at uh, Sunday, April 9th at 1 p.m. at Clubhouse 5. All right. Yes. Nice. <laughs> I'm, so it is almost sold out. It is very close to selling okay. out, yes. All right. Well, we'll make sure that we remind everybody <laughs> to get on that list. And then I also want to highlight, we have a series of movies uh, over at the Performing Arts Center. Mm -hmm. um, every month we have a different movie uh, being shown. Right. The next one that's coming up is on April 17th, a movie called Ticket to Paradise, starring Julia Roberts and George Clooney. It is a romantic comedy movie, uh, so, it, um, just, so just giving you a, 
the, I don't know, the encouragement to go it's and have cute. a good time. It's fun. You know what? <laughs> it's a fun movie, and you get to see it bigger than your TV. So, it, sure. and it's kind of like going to the movies anyway. So yeah, it's so nice. it's, it's free. You don't need a ticket to attend. Uh, you can bring in your own snacks, your own drinks, um, bring a friend, um, and have Perfect. a good time. I love it. That's awesome. And, and then why you've got another, so we've been, we've talked about this just a little bit, and mm -hmm. uh, it's almost sold out. Yes, it's almost sold out. So we have uh, Tony Orlando coming to the Performing Arts Center um, on Saturday, May 6th. Mm -hmm. um, there are some tickets left, but I just wanted to uh, let everyone know that we have sold about 700 tickets out of 800 tickets. So wow. if you are looking to go to the show, make sure to make your way down to the Performing Arts Center to okay. the box office okay. or online. Uh, you can purchase tickets online at tickets.lagunawoodsvillage.com. Mm -hmm. um, to select your seats and go to the show. Once again, it's on Saturday, May 6th with Tony Orlando at 7.30 p.m. at the Performing Arts Center. Fantastic. <laughs> well, you guys have your hands full all the time, and we yes. love the fact that you come up with some great things. So thank we you. We try our best. Thank <laughs> Good you. Good for you. If you want more information about any of the recreation activities that are happening here in the village, you can always email them at recreation at vmsinc.org. We'll be right back.